Welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I have a new product review. I have Chemical Guys Maxi Suds 2. So right here in my foam cannon I have it diluted. I have 200 milliliters in a thousand milliliter bottle. So I have it all set up. I'm going to bring you in and show you all the dirt here on this 2016 Mini Cooper four-door. And then I'm going to put it on the power washer and we're going to get to washing the car. So let's get started. Alright, so as we start around the back here, I want to show you all this dirt, bring you in real close. Got a lot, a lot of bird poop back here. That exhaust is kind of coated in a bunch of dirt, kicked on. Wheels, tires, dirty. Got a little bit of salt still on the paint. Talk off the license plate, so I'm going to get that clean under there because that's dirty. Should go through here. You can see a lot of the salt and sand. It's just been a crazy winter here in Virginia. Got that to remove. That's bird poop for sure. And then let's get to washing it. Alright, so now that I have the power washer hooked up to it, it's a Ryobli, uh 1800 uh, PSI uh, electric power washer. So let's get started. As you can see, the foam is really good that comes out of this uh, foam, um, out of the foam cannon with the maxi suds too. So as you can see. The foam that I got with the Chemical Guys Maxi Suds 2 is pretty freaking insane. It really does sun like they say it does. So, basically I had a little bit on there before. Then I just reapplied some more. Um, the dwell time, it can stay on there uh, for almost about five minutes. So that's pretty, uh, that's pretty impeccable. So, uh, basically, yeah. What I uh, did to start is I always clean the wheels off. Um, I put a degreaser on the tire and then a... Uh, wheel bright on the Meguiar's wheel bright on the wheels, and I clean I clean the wheels first, always do, for a wash the car. So uh, you can't really tell on the wheels because they're cleaned, but trust me, this car is <laughs> it's filthy. It hasn't been washed in over two months. So let's see what uh, this. So I want to see what the chemical guys Maxisids can do as like a pre soak. So let's see what it does. So that's pretty cool. It all came off pretty quick. Um, yeah, and I would say a lot of the dirt came off. Um, some of the stuff, there's some bugs, um, some tar kicked up on here that didn't come off. But overall, as a pre-treat, it's pretty freaking sick how much uh, what came off. So uh, next, I'm going to spray it again, and then I'll show you with a wash mitt. I'll show you and tell you about the lubricity. Also, the other thing to mention, this stuff smells amazing. It's a citrusy smell, so it's, it smells really good. So uh, let me get to that. All right, so now I got my bucket with my grit guard. I'm just gonna use one bucket. 
um, just for the make this video a little bit faster for myself. So basically start from the top to the bottom. Um, I sprayed some more soap on there. Um, I'm not going to do the very top but for the video purposes. There's no point because you can't see the roof. So ideally, no, you don't do that. But this stuff, it really does foam even when you put it in the bucket and you're just using a hose to help it. I mean, it's an insane amount of uh, suds. And the vibricity, like, the mid is just gliding right over the paint. So it's pretty freaking awesome. Ideally, you would uh, squeeze out, I mean, without having two buckets, like, you want to squeeze it out, bring it out, and then work it over the grit guard. But it's freaking awesome. <laughs> it's amazing how much suds there are on this. So. And ideally, you'd have two wash mitts, one for the bottom and then one for the top of the car. So, keep that in mind. But, we'll be fine. Uh, I mean, that is a ton of soap that comes out of there. And that is just awesome. <laughs> Holy moly. Yeah, this stuff smells really good. I just want to make sure I covered everything so that it represents that it, so when you see, when I wash this panel, you see that I actually got everything. And I'm not too worried about soil marks or anything on this car because uh, it has a coating on it and I need to reapply the coating to it anyways. So it's one of the good parts about it when you have a coating. Um, it's not going to prevent swore marks, but uh, the, so this is car pro, this is C-Quartz. The C-Quartz is a lot uh, tougher than the regular clear coat on the car, so it's pretty cool. But this one's uh, worn away, and you have to polish it anyways, preferably, before you apply the new one, so not too worried about swore marks. But still, I am being cautious, and... You might not like the wash technique that I just did there, but time is of the essence. The paint's not perfect to begin with. This car has 30,000 miles on it, and <laughs> it's not always washed. I don't have the chance to always wash this. Wash at the dealership, the car wash, so trust me, it's already scratched to begin with, so. You gotta be realistic with uh, your expectations. <laughs> You can tell all that soap came right off again and I mean it's sparkling but what I'm gonna do I'm gonna wash the rest of the car so that way I don't get any water spots on the car um, and then I'll come back and I'll show you the end result and I'll show you the car what it looks like all right stay tuned all right so I finished up I'm gonna walk you around the car so I would highly recommend you go pick up yourself some chemical guys maxi suds too this stuff worked amazing I mean look at that she looks awesome. So, as you can tell, that looks pretty freaking good. I gotta dry it off a little bit more. Um, gotta touch it up. I just tried the drawer GMs, but I still have some water running. But I mean, looks spectacular. Look at that shine. So yeah, definitely go pick yourself up. Some chemical guys, maxi suds too. And um, yeah, you don't have to have it in a foam cannon, but if you have a foam cannon, and I highly recommend it because it's amazing what it does in a foam cannon. The suds you get, the foam is thick, and the lubricity, it, it's amazing. There's, it's like your hand just glides right over it. It's amazing. 
So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And thanks again. Bye.